most women who undergo mastectomy consider the option of breast reconstruction. Years ago, the standard approach was to remove the entire breast with the nipple irregular complex and the skin in the central breast. Then the patient would wait several months to start the breast reconstruction at a second operation. Now there are better techniques, so the majority of women can have breast reconstruction performed immediately during the same operation as the mastectomy. A major advantage of immediate breast reconstruction is that the skin overlying the breast can be preserved, resulting in a more natural appearance of the reconstructed breast. There are two main types of mastectomy performed in the setting of immediate breast reconstruction. In a skin sparing mastectomy, the skin of the nipple and surrounding areola are removed along with the breast tissue. Then the nipple areolar complex can be reconstructed with surgery and or tattoos in the future. In a nipple sparing mastectomy, the breast is removed from under the skin and all of the breast skin is preserved, including the nipple and the surrounding areolar skin. With both the skin sparing and nipple sparing techniques, the breast reconstruction is started at the first operation and usually a second operation is needed to provide final shaping of the reconstructed breast. At Mayo Clinic, breast surgeons and plastic surgeons use a team approach in order to optimize both the cancer treatment and the cosmetic result. Nipple sparing mastectomy can often be performed with hidden scars that are located under the breast in the inframammary fold. Although one disadvantage of this technique is that after the surgery, the nipple will usually lose its normal sensation. During surgery at Mayo Clinic here in Rochester, Minnesota, all of the breast tissue that is removed at surgery does get checked by a pathologist, including the duct tissue directly under the nipple so that we can be sure all the cancer is removed completely at the first operation in almost all cases. Sometimes there are reasons that a skin sparing or a nipple sparing technique cannot be performed safely, either for cancer related reasons, blood supply concerns, or other factors related to an individual woman's health status. In order to determine if a skin sparing or a nipple sparing technique is possible in your situation, we recommend evaluations by both a breast oncologic surgeon and a plastic surgeon from our team.